Nice. Okay, Cindy. So for me, a model was 18 years old, 18 feet tall, and 18 pounds. So I looked in the mirror and I didn't see that. I never dreamed that I would be modeling. 59-year-old cover girl Cindy Joseph, the new poster girl for boomers reinventing themselves around the country's fastest growing demographic for almost everything. And we are the wealthiest, we're the biggest, we're active, we're buying stuff. Never a model in her youth, she is defying one of the most unforgiving age barriers of any profession by acting her age and throwing away the hair dye. The very day that I cut off the last bit of dye, I was approached by a casting agent who came up to me on the streets of New York and said, excuse me, but can we shoot a Polaroid of you? We'd love to use you for a Dolce & Gabbana campaign. And I was like, yeah, right. <laughs> Hello, Her discovery and first ad led to a contract with New York's prestigious Ford Modeling Agency, whose classic division is helping advertising clients catch the age wave and silver tsunami sweeping over the youth market. With the economy that we've experienced, advertisers need to send their message towards people that have money to buy the products, and that really is the boomer generation. It's not about aspiring to youth anymore. It's not about aspiring. We're people that are enjoying who we are and what we are. We're enjoying our lives. So we would like to see peers in ads. And so they're using people like me. And it, now it's going like wildfire. I go in, it's like what you see is what you get. I'm happy with it. If you want it, I'll sell it to you. <laughs> and if not, see ya. So that's the confidence that comes with experience. Having been there, having done that, you're not going to get us rattled. I am so thrilled to be in this place in my life. I am so happy to be done with all the insecurity of youth and know who I am, know what I want, know how to handle myself. Cindy is now leveraging her newfound modeling success into yet another new career the cosmetics business with her own line of makeup. I thought, wow, wouldn't it be awesome to make a cosmetic line just for us so we can be in the same club together and have a cosmetic line that was pro-age instead of anti-age? Boom or bust, Cindy is betting her modeling fees and her house on this new venture and all-consuming urge to reinvent herself and help others do the same. If you look at the baby boomer generation, Every single decade of our lives, we have reinvented what's gone on before. We're not sitting on the front porch knitting and rocking ourselves away. And who knows what's going to happen? It's a mystery to me. I am so excited to see what we're going to be doing in our 80s.